The following contest is a Hell in a Cell match and is for the WWE Universal Championship. Look who's on the big stage, Drew McIntyre. The Scottish Terminator right where he belongs, with all the eyes of the WWE Universe on him. McIntyre believes that he works harder than anyone else in the WWE locker room. Well, it's hard to argue with the results. Drew McIntyre has carved out a path of destruction since returning. He wants the main event spotlight, and he's got it. And now he's going to prove he belongs here. And he is willing to do whatever it takes. Worked his tail off to get back to WWE, and now is going to be the best. The head of the table has arrived. Complete domination of WWE. This has brought his family in the locker room in line. And we should all be thankful that WWE has Roman Reigns. The man who upholds the Anawai family legacy by any means necessary. Roman Reigns always in tremendous physical condition, probably the best shape of his career, but now more dangerous, more dominant, and more focused than ever. Will not relinquish his seat at the head of the table for anyone. Roman Reigns looking to continue expanding his empire. Introducing the challenger from Air Scotland, weighing in at 254 pounds, Drew McIntyre. And introducing the champion, from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds. He is the WWE Universal Champion, Roman Reigns! This is always a match with enormous implications for the landscape of the entire WWE. This capacity crowd is waiting with bated breath. The Universal Championship, it doesn't get bigger than this. The looks on these superstars' faces says it all. This is going to be one half of a fight. No one came here to lose, but there can only be one Universal Champion in the end. Better sell in, because I have a feeling this could be a grueling match. He finds a counter to McIntyre there. Each superstar trying to stay a step ahead. There's no way out, no disqualification, and one fall to the finish. Corey, how does a 
the superstar get the win in hell in a cell. You don't bear down and face your opponent in hell. The task at hand is the most important thing in the hell of a cell. Using the cell as part of your offense is also highly advised. Reigns gets out of hard to win. What a reversal by Reigns. Out of the ring and into hell itself. Fishing for something beneath the ring. He's got his hands on the back. One home run swing could end this match. Yes, he didn't come here to watch him boast and taunt. Able to interrupt the attack. He's able to fend off the attack. Brutal form. Triple an attack on the knee. Hits him with the counter. Definitely not where you want to be right now. Just carried like a ragdoll here. Drew fending him off. Oh no, out with the back. Home run. And it's scouted. Ooh. Ooh. Oh man. And the damage is just going to keep on coming if you can't find the defense for this. Crafty way to get out of home there. He deflects it right back. The big dog.
Are... Oh, gosh! As we all know, Hell in a Cell matches tend to deteriorate once the competitors leave the confines of the ring. things around. for destruction territory here. He's got a kendo stick, a weapon we've seen used to great effect time and time again. This win is a statement from Roman Reigns to the rest of WWE saying if Drew McIntyre couldn't beat me, how could you? Yeah, Roman came here tonight to end this rivalry and make an example of Drew. There's no question Reigns and McIntyre represent the very top. <laughs>